Okay, you guys, it's me again, yet again, coming at you today. Y'all know I don't kick out the videos like I used to. Been really busy. Y'all know I'm trying to build extra businesses and things like that. But today is one of those days, yes. So this is yet again another video. I got a package in the mail. Actually, I got one yesterday from my girl, Sand70. She has a YouTube page. All the information for the people I'm talking about is going to be below. Well, two people that actually sponsored the contest. Um, I received their uh, stuff yesterday. Um, your pleasure. Y'all know I call her mama pleasure. She been sending her stuff. Like, the contest started on January 15th. I probably had her package on the 17th. And that is an adult package for you to be romantic. It's just in time for Valentine's Day. So, my safe sisters, my Christian sisters out there, y'all already know. Don't act like y'all don't know what's going on. Y'all got husbands too. Ain't nothing wrong with being, you know, expressing your love for your partner with your partner. There's nothing wrong with that. So y'all don't have to be afraid at that of that package because um, your pleasure, Mama Pleasure was very respectful. Um, she does own a adult store, but she was very respectful in what she sent. I personally love what she sent. I have it myself. And you see me smiling. Enough said. Um, so that package, she been sent that like literally two days after the contest started. Sand sent me the package yesterday. And y'all already know Melissa Sense from Sensei sent me her package. And I got separately my package that I ordered from Sensei. Now, we're going to get into what's all in these packages. But when I say I love Sensei, I know people may don't agree with it. Let me take off my address stuff so y'all. I know a lot of people wonder why I love Sensei or if I was paid to talk about Sensei or whatever. I am in love with Sensei. When, I, when Melissa Sense sent me the product... I've been addicted ever since, y'all. And y'all already know that because I've already told you guys. I tried the Walmart brand. I did the Sensei versus Walmart video. Y'all already saw that. I'm just saying. I'm just a Sensei girl. That's all to it. But this is the package, y'all, that I ordered. <laughs> it's ridiculous. That's the package I ordered from Sensei. Yeah, so if y'all want to order anything, go to Melissa Sense. Um, again, everything will be in, in the box below. Um, this is my invoice. All of that. <laughs> Ridiculous. But I have to start off and show you guys. Now, y'all already know I'm a really big, huge fan of San 70. Um, for people that's been following my channel, y'all already know her um, website that she has is called uh, Scent of a Queen and I'm going to include it like I said below but she hands makes she hand makes everything you guys and we have to learn how to support people not just big businesses like CVS, Walgreens Walmart, Rite Aid uh, we need to learn how you know Conway the places like that we need to learn how TJ Maxx, Ross, Marshalls we need to learn how to support People we know that this money directly goes to especially when they have great products that's the thing why if one place has a big name a chain of stores has a great product why do we always run to that product when we get that product from somebody that we know that has a great product as well we know it's directly going to feed their family and the product is equally as good or not if not better and most of the time you can get a better price I don't understand the concept. Uh, I'm going to do a video one day on probably tomorrow or day after tomorrow. I'm going to try to get it in. But I want to do a video on that because I have found, even with my transportation company, I've endured that. Where people um, will support bigger companies um, just simply because they're a bigger company. And I found, in fact, not to go too far into it, but I found that a lot of people, when they know it's going directly to your pocket and feeding your family and helping you progress, that's why they don't want to they don't want to support you because they don't want to see the direct blessing in your life that their dollar will make 
I'm just saying that's that's a whole nother ball game. I'm a very observant person. I pretty much know things like this because I've done business for a long time. Not only have I been a consumer, but I've been a business owner for many, many years. So I've looked at what people do and how people interact and how people act towards you and also other businesses. But that's neither here nor there. I will be doing a video on that for sure. We're going to get into it. But I want you guys to support these people that sponsored this contest. The contest started on December the 15th. It ends on January the 15th. And this is one of the reasons why. Not only I chose these people to be um, in, as a sponsor. The reason why is because it was something that they had that I liked that I considered the favorite thing of mine. It was something that they produced, whether they worked for a company or they owned their own company, that I thought was something different, unique, and great. Okay, I saw greatness in their product, their delivery, their creativity, um, them as an overall person, and that's why I chose certain people. Now, there is one person that has not gotten back to me in a long time. Um, I don't know if they are going to not provide the items that they spent, you know, that I chose for the contest for their company. I'm not going to mention their name right now. I will be mentioning their name for sure after the contest is over if they don't deliver. Um, because we did this on good faith. We, it wasn't something I made people send to me right this second before the contest even started. I believe when they said that they were going, they asked to be a sponsor. I told, I told them what products I liked that they were offering. They agreed and I took it as that. Now, if they don't provide what, what it is that they are supposed to provide, I will go in my pocket and give other things. That's not a problem. So whoever wins is going to get plenty of stuff. When I said the value of the contest is going to be almost $400 or over $400, I meant what I said. So if I have to go, me, Daddy and I go in our own pocket to provide whatever that person don't provide, you best to believe Keon and Chuck is going to make it happen. Period. Point blank. So... Um, Sands sent if you've been watching I told you guys I have a bracelet the basketball wives inspired spike bracelet I have the bracelet I can't reach it right now but I have the bracelet so Sands being the diva that she is she actually sent and made these so these are actually handmade for you guys she actually handmade these earrings for you guys for the winner of the contest yes she handmade these you guys and she sells them on her site so make sure you go check out scent of a queen um that's her site you can also go check out her channel where she has links to all the stores because she also has another store as well but her channel is Sands S-A-N-D-S I believe you can put an S on it or not I don't know I don't remember 70 and I will put the correct um, channel name below but yeah so you'll be rocking the winner will be rocking the earring and the spike bracelet that has the same like diamond out blinged out things you and it's all around the whole bracelet you will be rocking this as well with all the other stuff that you're getting as well but I had to show you guys not only that you all know I am from be more I born and raised was born and raised in Merlin so you know the Ravens in the house okay why my girl sent these Chuck literally when he seen these on her site, he was like, babe, you got to get these. She sent these, and he went berserk. He all put it on Facebook and everything, his Facebook channel. Where they do that at? Where do they do that at? With the little basketball wife diamond thing? Yeah. Tell me this sister ain't creative. And then she can make them any size for you, whether you want them big or small. She know I do the big stuff. She can do any team, you guys. So I just thought that would be a divalicious thing to do for like, you know, when you're watching football with your your hubby and to be rocking his sports team. He gonna love it. Just, just they love that kind of stuff. So 
go check the sister out. The sister is bad. And then she sent for the winner. It's called Scent of a Queen Whipped Body Butter. This is called Barbara's F Flower. And I think this is because of the um, somebody that, the, I think the founder of Breast Cancer Awareness, it's a dedication to her, which is a wonderful thing. And this is called uh, Mango Bliss. And it has her site, Scent of a Queen. She makes these herself. And this is the website. Trying to get it right, y'all. There you go. Scentofaqueen.com. When I, I did a review on this, you guys, and it's called, if you go back all the way back and look at that review, it got like, it, it literally has like 10,000 views or more, something like that. If you go to that video, it's like 15,000 views. If you go to that video, it's called, I want to lick it. When I tell you this sister, it's the business. When I tell you this is the business, I mean what I say. First of all, this lasts a long, long time. Second of all, the smell is like ridiculous. Mm, this is the mango bliss. Sans, if you sending this, if you seeing this, this video, I need this. I need this up in my life. I need two four ounce jars. Please let me know how much it's gonna cost me, please. Cause Valentine's Day coming up and Chuck will fall in love all over again with this. Oh my god. Mm. I wanna lick it though. I do want to lick it, y'all. But this is just, it's, it's ridiculous. And when you put it on your skin, you guys, literally, I showed you on that video when I put it on my skin, you could tell the difference instantly in my skin. That's why I did a before and after live so y'all could see it. So look at that video. It's called I Want to Lick It. If you don't believe what I'm saying about her products, look at that video. And that's all I got to say. Now, Barbara's Flower, that smell good, too. You know what it smells like? I can't pinpoint. It smells like coconut, a little pineapple, like a flower scent. To, it's just real, real, real nice. Mmm. Ooh, that's nice too. I need four ounces of this at least. So all together, I need, I need about, th I need two of these, the Mango Bliss, and give me two of these Barbara's Flower send my invoice to me on email sans please but these are for the winner so that is um one of the things and melissa melissa sense sent this full size 35 dollar warmer for the winner of the contest yes i said 35 or 40 dollar warmer I want to see what it look like. Oh, it's, so it's a neutral color, you guys, because the winner, y'all will get this. Look how it look. Ain't that really pretty? That is so pretty. And just imagine, you see those little holes? The light goes through it once you plug it in. And then this is the lid to it. That is really pretty. So it's a neutral color. That was a good idea, Melissa. This is a neutral color. So this will go with anybody's color scheme. You know how we divas are. We wanted to go with the color scheme. So, this is like a, it's called crinkle because it has that crinkle finish. It's a neutral color, so you can use it in a nursery. You can use it in um, your living room. You can use it in your bathroom, depending on the size of your bathroom and your vanity. Uh, because I actually have one for every room. Uh, when I say I'm a sensei lover, I'm not just saying that. They're not paying me to say it. It's just the business for me. It just does something to me. I love it. Daddy loves it. It just creates an atmosphere that's like really, really nice. Um, I just love it. Now, as far as my sensei, I ordered I ordered this one for my flea market stand. Yes, because it's a diva boutique stand, it has to have a diva sensei product as well. And I don't know if I've shared this with you guys, but my color scheme for the Diva Boutique at the flea market is turquoise and zebra print. Yeah, even my bags are zebra print. And um, so I ordered this Sensei, yes, for the Diva flea market stand. 
so that when people come past my table, they are able to smell Sensei as well. So that's one of the things that separates my stand from others. This is the top, and I got, I think, 16 cents. And the scents last forever. I literally probably won't have to buy no more scents. Because I still have about 12 different packs right now. I pro literally won't have to buy with this. Because since they last is a long time. I won't have to buy any scents probably the whole year. Will I buy them? I probably will. But I won't have to. So if you want to see the next video on the haul of all of my scents. And my reaction to all the scents and flavors and all that. Yeah. So. Sensei. And also below, you will also have um, Sand 70. And make, make sure you check out your pleasure. Be blessed.